Good evening everyone, I am Obi-Wan, yes, that Obi-Wan, and welcome to NXT. What a show we have for you tonight. Heavy Machinery goes one-on-one -on -one with the Street Profits in the main event, but let's kick things off with the NXT Cruiserweight Champion. As the NXT Champion has been on quite a row as of late, defending against Mustafa Ali a few weeks ago for the NXT Cruiserweight Championship, good things will happen to that man in the future. As we get ready for TakeOver New Orleans. And making his debut on NXT, Tyler Bate. Will he? Yes, yes, I, I, I see the mustache, man. Very, very nice. Will Tyler Bate be an impact player as he goes up against the Cruiserweight Champion? Or better yet, if he beats the Cruiserweight Championship, again, give that man a title shot for NXT TakeOver New Orleans. We also seen the debut of Heavy Machinery a few weeks ago. And again, they are looking like they will take on the NXT Tag Team Champions and the Street Profits. Ah, uh, here we go. This is your opening match to start off. Drew Gulak going up against Tyler Bate as the referee calls for the bell. And here we go. And Gulak now with a scoop slam. Again attacking the arm trying to get ready for and the sheer strength starting off with a gut wrench. Nice uppercut by Tyler Bate. As Bate now in position and connects with a nice snap suplex It goes into the cover. And again, just a quick one count. Also tonight, we will see the agents go up against a few members of Platinum Plus in the women's division. And what a move by Tyler Bate, ranking and reaching the arm back. Trying to go for something, but Drew Gulak gets out the way and connects with a clothesline. And it has been all Gulak in the moment. Multiple stumps to the face. But again, he had to look at the opportunity. A kick to the head. And Tyler Bate with a close line over the top and to the outside. I'm assuming that the referee... The referee... See, th this is the reason why, ref. Th this is why you are going to get kicked in your damn face. Ugh. As we go into the outside and back into the inside, we're going all over the damn place. As Gulak goes over the barricade, elbow by Tyler Bay, but a right hand punch and a knee to the gut. And here we go. Again, referee, I'm kind of shocked that you didn't tell me, but then again, you're the referee, so I don't know what the hell is going on. Hit butt to the back of the head. Nice reversal by Tyler Bate. And Bate now with right hand punches and an uppercut. And this is getting out of hand real quick, real fast. And how awesome it is as Gulak with another right hand punch. Multiple shots with the right hand and another knee to the gut. And again, we are going into dangerous territory chairs. There's a table. There's a trash can. There's the audience. Multiple kicks to the gut. And what a kick taken down. And not, well, I don't know. Is it really a kick to the Hurricane Rana? Yeah. All over the damn place. As Gulak gets out the way. Goins with another Hurricane Rana. 
through the damn table. And another shot. Monkey flipped into the trash can and didn't sell and didn't budge. You know, as we go more extreme on NXT, nice uppercut. And into another Hurricane Rana by Tyler Bate. And it has all been Tyler Bate as he is making his way back into the ring. Can we see that again? Can we see that Hurricane Rana through the table? Fantastic as now. Drew Gulak is making his way back into the inside of the ring. Hop over the barricade. Referee. Uh, you you kind of need an ass whooping. And Drew Gulak into the Dragon Sleeper. And will it be all over? As Tyler Bate trying to get out of that predicament. And Tyler Bate has tapped out as the referee calls for the bell. And what a victory by Drew Gulak. Went through a table. Running Hurricane Rana. And give it up. Again, this man is on top of his game. As we will be right back with more of NXT. And the agents picking up the victory last week. It was actually Clover and Alex taking on Sydney and Crystal Platinum. That body splash leg drop connection off the top rope. Outstanding as Alex and Clover pick up the victory. Some more tag team action tonight dealing with the agents and going up against Platinum Plus as a whole. This is good for the NXT Women's Champion. Andrea the Giant and taking the pressure off. Dealing with the, the three on one attacks, the four on one attacks. And their opponents, Platinum Cameron Danielson and Christina. And again for Platinum Plus, their mission is to take the NXT Women's Championship off of Andrea the Giant. Kind of failed a few weeks ago. As again, at that five-way match for the NXT Women's Championship, Andrea came out on top. Yet again, it was her versus all members of Platinum Plus. As this war between Platinum Plus and Andrea the Giant continues. And again, it is... Very fortunate that the agents who made their debut a few weeks ago stepped up and stepped in and helped the NXT Women's Champion. But this should be a good, I think this should be a regular tag team matchup. I don't know, seeing as that the referee is just being an idiot. And so here we go as Clover. Started things off going up against Cameron Danielson. Referee calls for the bell and here we go. It's Cameron now. Multiple shots to the gut. Trying to go for a uppercut. Nice counter by Clover. It's Clover throws. And what a move. A close line bulldog combination. Just classic. It's Clover now. Throws Cameron into the turnbuckle. Trying to go for attack, but a good reversal. As Danielson now, or Platinum, excuse me. Trying to go for attack, and again, a nice counter by Clover. As Clover now connects with a backbreaker. And a nice reversal by Cameron Platinum. Danielson's her, um... Real name, but we're just not going to talk about that. Tag is made, and here comes Christina Platinum. And connects with a double, a double backdrop. See, it can't even words tonight. It's been one of those nights. Good counter by Clover. And a knee to the face. 
taking a page out of that Triple H. And the double hair whip to the back. As Clover now. Trying to go over seeing you can make a tag. And again another clothesline bulldog combination. And into is that a whippersnapper? Alrighty then. That damn whippersnapper, I'm telling you, man. And again, multiple rakes to the face taken down. The leader of Platinum Plus as Clover setting up. Ah, uh, shit, I think it's time to let her go. Hits her with the TKO. As Clover goes into the cover, in comes Sam to kind of help, maybe, hopefully. There you go, referee. One, two, three, and the agents again pick up the victory. It was really not even a tag team match, but there you go. It looks like the agents have Platinum Plus's number. As we will be right back with your main event, some tag team action, heavy machinery, and street profits. And what an opportunity for heavy machinery as, again, this is your main event of the evening. Some classic tag team action. Thank you. Thank you for telling me. The referee calls for the bell. And here we go. As heavy machinery won a three-way tag team match a few weeks ago. And they are the number one contenders for the NXT Tag Team Championships. Nice supper cut by Angelo. Trying to go for a close line and Otis is having nothing of it. Connects. With a belly to belly suplex. Running style. Nice scoop slam by Angelo Dawkins. As it's time for a little bit of head holding. Keep your head holding. Keep your head together. And again, nice back body drop by Otis. But yeah, winning that three-way tag match, the claws coming to get you. It was heavy machinery for Breeze and the New Day. Nice shoulder block tag, um, takedown rather. As Angelo throws into the corner, the tag is made, and here comes Montez Ford. And connects with a close line. And another close line. And that's why they are the NXT Tag Team Champions. Well, let me tell you something, brother. That's Montez now. An attack and delay. Again, I I'm not sure if that's good strategy, seeing as that he picked Otis back up. But okay, let's, let's go with that. And Otis... Connects with Snake Eyes. And again, can the momentum change for Heavy Machinery as again the claw is coming to get them? Scared of the claw. You scared of the claw. Sorry. Um, and Otis now goes into the corner to see if he can make the tag, and the tag is made to Tucker. Nice jawbreaker getting out of that situation. Trying to go with a heel kick. 
trying to go for a spinning or a twisting body splash. Tucker gets out the way. And again, going back into the snapmare, just some basic fundamentals. And a kick to the back. As Tucker now picks Montez back up. Trying to go for something and then to the DDT. Again, attacking the air. I mean, that's good strategy. That's the pan. What a move. A back body drop to the outside. And the referee now initiates the 10 count. Thank you. And again, my test just throws Tucker back into the inside of the ring. The referee breaks the 10 count. And my test now setting up. And connecting again with another DDT. And again, it's only a matter of time. And here comes the Profits. I'm trying to go for attack. And what a shot taken down. Angelo Dawkins. And what a right hand shot. Back and forth. And here we go. And what a main event it has been. And a close line taken down. My task four. And Otis. Throws Angelo Dawkins through the ropes. And a right hand shot taking him down. And it has all been heavy machinery. And again what a main event it has been. As again now Tucker focused on the arm of Montez Ford. And again nice kicks to the quad. And what a reversal by Tucker. And again, the tag is desperately made. And the knee to the face. At least it's not Alistair Black style. But nonetheless, again, Tucker setting up and going into the Boston Crab. And will this be all over? And the leg strength of Matez Ford getting out of that predicament. Trying to go for another DDT. Multiple punches to the gut. And it again, and again, the tag is made too. And here we go, setting up. And what a move by Otis, and going straight into the cover, and that is all over. And Angelo Dawkins with the breakup. And again, going back into the cover, one. And again, another kick out. And down goes the referee, and what a STO by Tucker. And again, Heavy Machinery is on their game tonight. And now here comes Otis. And what an elbow drop. And I think now it's time to set it up. Going for the finisher again. As again, Otis throws Montez into the corner. And the tag is made, and here we go again. And now I think it's Tucker's turn. Tucker in position, and Otis, and what a move! And then it's all over. Count them, ref. One, two, three. And Heavy Machinery has picked up the victory. And like I said, give those guys a title shot. I am Obi-Wan, thank you for NXT, we will see you next week.